What's up guys, if you are searching for a best camera phone under $500 in 2020, then this video is for you. In this video, I am going to show you the best camera phone which also offers great performance and comes at the price range under $500. Please hit the like button, do share this video and subscribe my channel. OnePlus 70 If you are a fan of Oxygen OS or OnePlus in general, then the latest OnePlus 70 is the one to get. The smartphone can indeed be found for less than $500. The phone comes with a powerful Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 Plus. 8GB of RAM and 256GB of fast UFS 3.0 storage. The handset also shines for its large 6.5 inch fluid AMOLED display with a 90Hz refresh rate. While in the camera department we have a primary 48MP sensor paired with a 12MP telephoto lens and a 16MP ultra wide angle camera. On the front, the selfies are taken care of by a 16MP sensor. Finally, the OnePlus 70 is fueled by a 3800 image capacity battery with support for 30 watt fast charging and it runs Oxygen 10 OS based on Android 10. Links are given in the description, you can buy it from there. Oppo Reno Ace Oppo Reno Ace coming once again with the powerful Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 Plus along with a minimum of 8GB of RAM and 128GB of internal storage. We then find a 6.5-inch 90Hz eSports ready screen and a 4 rear cameras on the back including a main 48MP sensor along with a 13MP ultra-wide angle and an 8MP telephoto with 2MP of depth sensor. For selfies, we have a single 16MP selfie camera which takes amazing selfies. The smartphone supports the new 65W SuperVOOC Super Flash Charging, meaning it can charge the 4000mAh capacity battery completely in just 30 minutes, with 5 minutes of charging that can bring around 2 hours to 6 hours of autonomy. So this phone is just amazing, packs amazing features, links are given in the description, you can buy it from there. Vivo Eco Neo 855 Racing Edition Yet another great option powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 Plus is a recently launched Vivo Eco Neo 855 Racing Edition which is available for less than $500. The handset comes with either 8GB or 12GB of RAM with 128GB of internal storage along with previously mentioned CPU. We then have a 6.38 inch Super AMOLED display with full HD plus resolution with an aspect ratio of 19.5 is to 9. In the camera department, the smartphone is equipped with a main 12MP sensor and a second 8MP ultra wide angle lens and a third 2MP depth sensor which guarantees amazing picture quality. On the front, we instead have a 16MP of selfie snapper to take amazing selfies. Finally, the Vivo Eco Neo 855 Racing Edition comes. Finally, the Vivo Eco Neo 855 Racing Edition comes with an extra large 4500mAh capacity battery that supports fast charging at 33W and runs FunTouch 9.1 OS based on Android 9 Pie out of the box. Links are given in the description, you can buy it from there. Realme X2 Pro the handset does indeed manage to pack the latest Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 Plus for less than $500. You can even get it under $400 if you are willing to only 64GB of storage. The Realme X2 Pro then features a large 6.5 inch display of AMOLED type with full HD plus resolution and a 90Hz refresh rate. Meanwhile in the camera department we find a 64MP primary shooter accompanied by an 8MP ultra wide angle lens and a 13MP tele photo camera and a 2MP depth sensor. At the front, we have a 16MP camera for high resolution selfies. Finally, the Realme's flagship which is again a flagship killer packs a large 4000mAh capacity battery that supports 50 watt fast charging. It also comes with a headphone jack NFC, and runs ColorOS 6.1 based on Android 9. Links are given in the description, you can buy it from there. Redmi K20 Pro Premium Edition this is one of the best handsets with the best specs to performance ratio on the market. The smartphone differs from the base Redmi K20 Pro in the CPU on board. The latter does indeed pack the most powerful Qualcomm Snapdragon 855 Plus paired with 12GB of RAM and a whooping 512GB of internal storage. And yes, that will only cost you and yes, that will cost you less than $500. Other features include a 6.39 inch AMOLED panel with a real 
full screen design and under display fingerprint scanner. Meanwhile on the camera side we find a mains 48MP Sony IMX Fire 6 shooter paired with an 8MP telephoto and a 13MP ultra wide angle lens. This phone packs 4000mAh of battery, supports fast charging at 27W and runs MIUI based on Android 9. So these are our top 5 best camera phones that you can buy for under $500. If you have any other phone in your mind, please comment in the comment section. Do share this video among your friends. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.